Hi everyone, Just for Sweets here. Just a quick video. Um, I have been on a weight loss journey, which I told you in my last video, um, trying to just shed some of the pounds and eat healthier, become healthier because I stand on my feet. And I wanted to share with you um, the snacks and some of the foods that I eat. So if anybody is out there struggling or trying to lose weight, or I don't even want to say lose weight, maybe just changing your lifestyle and eating better, I wanted to share with you some of the things that I did. Um, I have lost 40 pounds up to this day. Today is October 1st, and I started my journey the very beginning of May. So in five months, 40 pounds, no gimmicks, nothing. I use my fitness pal on my phone and uh, log my calories every day. I also use Map My Run, and I only walk a couple times a week, two to three if I'm lucky. Um, and they're long walks. Sometimes they're three miles, sometimes they're four or five. Five is about the most I've ever gone, um, but I do that a couple times a week. So let me share with you what I, what I eat and snack on. Um, I eat about every two to three hours a day. I eat the Greek yogurt that is the 80 calories or the 80 calories, no, more than 80 calories. I'm sorry about that. I eat these cottage cheese doubles, which are 100 calories, and um, those are really easy to pack and take with you to work or wherever. Um, I eat about a tablespoon of peanut butter a day. You can get um, powdered peanut butter, which has less calories, and then you just rehydrate it with water. And I think that has 45 calories a serving. I also have that and use that from time to time. Um, I get these little ready pack snacks at Costco. They're 150 calories, but they have the cheese, the pretzels, carrots, and grapes. These are great when I'm like in between clients and I just need something to snack on really quick. I think they sell them at grocery stores as well. I still drink my coffee every day um, with organic sugar. I use about a teaspoon and then I use um, the Coffee Mate Natural Bliss or half and half. I don't use the fat free because those are filled with a lot of chemicals. Um, these organic caprese salads I get at Costco and sometimes I will make a chicken breast and cut up half of it and put it on top. I have apples. Um, banana goes in my smoothie every morning. It's a half a banana normally um, and I usually freeze them but if I don't have a banana in a smoothie then I'll take one as a snack. I eat a lot of sweet potatoes. I do eat regular potatoes as well but sweet potatoes are my favorite so I do eat a lot of those. In fact I had one last night with a tablespoon of butter for dinner and um, some smoked chicken. It was really good. Um, these Fiber One bars are great. These are the rice rollers. You get these at Costco. They're 45 calories each and they are so yummy dipped in the peanut butter. So that's where I use my peanut butter. I eat one rice roller and a tablespoon of peanut butter and that's usually like a mid-morning snack or a late afternoon snack. One of my favorite things is this Skinny Pop popcorn also at Costco, but I believe you can get it at grocery stores too. Um, these are the individual bags. So each of these bags are 100 calories. So it's easy for you to pick up and eat if you're in a hurry on the go. Um, th this I take a lot. I keep this in stock at all times. Um, if you don't want to spend the money buying the box of the individually packed ones, you can buy a large bag, I think, for like $4.99 or $5.99. And you can just put it into individual baggies. Um, the Fiber One bars are really good. The oats and chocolate, I think they're roughly around $130, $140 in calories. Um, this is my protein powder that I use every morning. Um, the serving size is two and I use one scoop. Um, I don't use two scoops because I'm, I'm not trying to get muscular or anything. I'm just trying to maintain my weight. So a lot of times I'm on the run. I might add some chia seeds to it, but usually it's the organic protein powder, half a banana. I use almond milk with it, not regular milk, the almond milk unsweetened version, um, sometimes vanilla unsweetened and sometimes just the regular unsweetened, but I always use the almond milk. If you can't use that, then try using rice milk, coconut milk. I try to stay away from the regular dairy milk. Um, these are Kids Cliff Protein Bars. They come in a case at Costco. This one I happen to get at Target because it's Halloween. Um, but these are great little snacks, and every time I punch them into my fitness pal, it says that I that they are very high in vitamin A. So I don't buy the full protein bars that are like roughly 210 to 290 calories. I just buy the kids version and then that's a really good snack for me to eat in between just to hold me over or maybe at night when I want something sweet. Um, this one's peanut butter and chocolate and this bar has 140 calories and it is really, really yummy um, for uh, nighttime when I'm really wanting that 
that sweet something after dinner. Um, I do eat some Progresso soup on the nights that I work late. Um, these cans, I believe, have 200 calories if you eat the full can, 100 if you eat um, half the can. I normally will eat a full can, and I might have it with some crackers or I'll find something else to have with it. Um, I found these sweet potato crackers, and these are really good inside of this cranberry almond chicken salad. This um, I get at Costco. I don't know if they sell it anywhere else, but it is absolutely delicious. It's got the almonds, the celery, and the cranberries in with it. A lot of times I'll make a sandwich on that flatbread that has 100, and cal 100 calories, or I will just take one of the little containers, because um, it has the little containers like this, to work with me and if I don't have time to make a sandwich in the morning and then I'll bring myself some of these sweet potato crackers or wheat thins or whatever I just make sure to portion it out to what they say the portion size is so that I put it into my fitness pal um, we found these at Costco these are really yummy I would not eat a full serving because six of them is like six is 160 calories so I normally cut my serving in half and I'll eat maybe three of these because I love coconut and they are absolutely amazing. They have some sesame seeds in them and they're really, really yummy. So I've been eating these. I might eat two or three. Um, one of my favorite snacks to cure my chocolate craving, chocolate and salt, are these uh, pretzel crisps. And they have them in the dark chocolate crunch. I get those at Costco as well, but I know the grocery stores have them. Um, those are just a few of the items I eat. Uh, I log every single item except for on my cheat day. I do allow myself one cheat day a week. And that cheat day, I pretty much drink my Starbucks or my fancy coffees and eat my chicken my chicken fingers or my chicken wings or my pizza. And I don't log that day. I just go ahead and make it a free-for-all and then get right back on track the next day. So anyway, um, I wanted to share these items with you for anybody that's on a weight loss journey or just getting healthier and show you some of the alternatives that are out there that are easy to find, affordable, delicious, and satisfy all those cravings. Um, and as I told you before, I'm starting a new channel called All for Beauty, A-L-L, -L, the number four, and then beauty. Um, I went ahead and started the channel. I have not posted any videos on there as of right now. Um, so if you want to go over there and check that out and just subscribe to that page, you'll start seeing that. Those are just going to be some beauty tips because that's the industry I'm in. When I hit my 50 pound weight loss goal, which is 10 more pounds, I will do a video showing my whole body. Um, anyway, have a wonderful day, everyone. Thanks for watching and God bless.